Welcome to this Windows Computer and Technology update. And uh, one of the things that's interesting in here is about the Android updates. Uh, we talked about how we've got to stay safe. We've got to keep up to date to make sure that everything is fine. And one of the problems with this, uh, we talk about how manufacturers, some have long delays before an update actually gets into your device. And Microsoft, uh, Android, uh, a Google security team, and uh, some security researchers actually have talked about this recently, saying that this creates a huge security hazard for Android users. So we talk sometimes about something called zero days. Zero days are the updates that are the, uh, the flaws or the security hazard, the security flaws that are discovered and uh, that are brand new and you've got to I mean, understand that uh, manufacturers will of course with zero days apply as fast as possible security fixes for them and there's a lot of those on every system uh, windows mac linux and of course on the case of also um, android but the problem on android is because there's so many different manufacturers that update at different times that when zero day flaws are discovered before they actually apply to a lot of phones you have what's called n days security flaws what are n days n is for the number of days between the official fix has been released for android and the official time your manufacturer will actually apply that fix to your phone or tablet and they say that more and more as time goes by, this is a huge security hazard. Why? Because by the time it gets to your phone, these updates might actually already be exploited on pretty much multiple devices because for a simple reason, the bad guys, the hackers know about them and they know how to exploit them. So what they're saying is that this needs to be eliminated. There needs to be a way that everybody will update their security at the same time so uh, for example I was looking here at the last update on my phone which uh, was done on July 22nd now that July 22nd update is and has applied the July security patches for Android on my uh, s22 my galaxy s22 ultra thing is by July 22nd it was already more than two and a half weeks since they had released these fixes for Android and they contain zero days and very important flaws which means that my phone technically was almost 20 days with huge security flaws that could be exploited and that is unacceptable and I mean this is for my phone some manufacturers take even more time than that to apply. Some take months for that to happen. And not counting, of course, all the phones that don't get security patches anymore. So this is a huge security update and uh, or security flaw, sorry. And there's a lot of talk about how this needs to change in order for all of that to uh, actually, um, you know, make sure that everybody are safe on their devices so there needs to be a change in, in the android way of doing things that's for sure and you know android is the only operating system that allows that um if you're in a mac if you're on windows windows gets every windows pc gets the same updates at the same time um you know linux same thing uh, mac of course every device every mac every ipad every iphone there is no difference why is that accepted in android it is unacceptable as it's a huge security hazard. We're going to wait for what? For a huge security flaw to be exploited and people are going to be going crazy before somebody decides that we have to do something about it? I think not. I think we got to do something now. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.